Is it? Is it? Yes, the source of the darkness. It's coming. This is your moment. Oh. Okay guys, welcome to part four of my Hellblade playthrough. And last time we defeated Sutir and Valraven. Well, not last time. Time for that we defeated Valraven. So now we have unlocked the symbols to open this door. So here we go, we're gonna go through it. Why is she waiting? Don't open she the gate! Open no, the gate. Don't. don't! It's dangerous, it's dangerous, don't open the gate! Don't. She's done it. No one here but me. Not you. Did you think that I let you go? That you lost me back in the wilds? I will never let you go. You can't get rid of me. I am your shadow. And I will be watching when you draw your last dying gasp. I'm not ready to die. You will be when you see what they did to your dear beloved. The darkness touched you. 
Everyone could see it in the hollows of your eyes. A gaze averted from life. You ran from it, but brought it nearer. Led it to him. An endless suffering, worse than death. And you wanted to surrender. Abandoned to find peace with the gods. No. The darkness won't allow it. So you will walk into the lair of the beast. Look it in the eye and you will go to war. This is your mission. This is your quest. There is okay, so we do get to go over this bridge. So obviously this is like the, the area that we kind of started in before and we worked our way around the bank here. Okay, so worth mentioning is... Okay, shit, we've got enemies. Okay, hang on. So anyway, worth men all right, what's the controls again? All right, focus, move. All right, fast strike, heavy strike, melee, bl right, block evade, fast strike, heavy strike. Okay. <laughs> Boom. The gods made you a warrior for a reason. It's your calling. <laughs> Oh, cool, he fell off the bridge, that's cool. Okay, so what I was going to say is that I went back and... Um, found the two floor stones that I was missing. Uh, which took like 45 minutes. So I did that this morning because uh, this is the day after I did like the first three parts. So that's where I had to like refresh on what the uh, controls were. But yeah, okay. So it's still. Able to do it. I grabbed it die straight away and like cost myself a life. After I just started. Okay, is this gonna be like a new enemy type or is this like a mini box or something? Okay, so I think we just lost life there, even after I literally said I don't want to leave life straight away. So that's great timing. I dodged it, I dodged it though, I was just doing the usual like rolling one out of the way kind of thing. But he still hit me. So whatever. Fuck. No, two. Come on, get up. Fuck right now. Behind you. Is that? Are we dead? Are we dead? Get up! Get up! Get up! Get up! Come on. They're winning. Okay, now we're dead. What is going on right now? Okay. I'm gonna have to start using my focus more. Defend yourself. 
What the shit? Okay, so your life regenerates, I think. So I should have pretty much just like died right there by busy, so Okay, so we can hit them both at the same time. No! No! Okay, I couldn't even see because of that pillar there, but we still... I wonder if they can hit each other or not. Hopefully it'll regenerate on its own. I don't know what they have to like... Um... Like, fight to... Do it back because I'm sure I've played a game like that before where the only way that you could regain um, like health when you were losing it was to actually like fight so Warstone. However you come to the gold covered bridge that leads to hell, you may find it guarded by a giantess. She will ask your name. She will ask your lineage. She will ask your business. The Northmen tell of the warrior woman Brynhild, who leapt into fire and rode to hell to join her slain love Sigurd, and is challenged by the giantess. Okay, so obviously we'll have to work our way around and we'll take the bar off the back of the that. The journey to Helheim is never a straight one. Each must find their own path. Oh. Align yourself to its secrets and you will find yours. No. Focus. Focus. Oh, where was like the pair? Okay, we go. Okay, that's a new thing. How do we get to it though? Oh, maybe that, was it in the was it in the room we just came out of? Why am I stuck on a oh, plank? Okay, I'm going to guess that that's just in the room that we were just in. So let's try and go backwards through that hall. And hopefully that'll work. Yeah, okay, good. Okay, there's an X around here. Okay, there we go, it's going to be swing through. Alright, now there's an S up here. Okay, so there's these things hanging down. There's an X up there. There we go. 
I don't know if we meant to go that way, if this is like... Oh, low stone. The ones here are like much... Okay, and there's a door to the thing, okay. So I think we do have to like go around that thing. Hela possesses large dwelling places in Helheim. Tall are her walls, high are her gates. The name of her dish is hunger. Her knife is famine. On her threshold all will stumble. Her bed is called sick bed, and her bed hangings are called flames of a funeral pyre. They say she is easy to recognize. Half black and half the color of flesh. And her face menacing and grim. Okay, so I'm gonna go along the side of here to see what there is. Face. Oh, Senua. Your father does not hate me. He just fears the souls in the underworld. He cannot see that they are already afraid. But I am their healer, and I must answer their cries for help, even if it displeases him. Okie dokie. So I think for that X, because it's being made out of that um, like hanging thing, I think you can pretty much just look up at it from the floor. But I want to open that door, so I'm going to go that way and then through to the, the hall again. So, down here. And then open this. It kind of reminds me of um, the Abstergo logo from Assassin's Creed. That one. Okay, so I'm guessing we're going to have more enemies in here. So I'll try not to die this time. Or not. So I guess we're meeting Helen. Who is it? It's coming. That song again. Is it? Is it? Is it? It's Helen. Yes. The source of the darkness. It's coming. This is your moment. Oh. I'm sorry. It's like Snoke from Star Wars. What are you doing? You're showing weakness. That's creepy though. You're not a warrior. You're a disgrace. The gods will punish you for this. Pick up the sword. Pick it up. Fight the darkness. Fight it. Get up. Get up. Get up and fight! Cool.
stormy seas and lost souls. She's dreamt of this before. They say dreams are visions of our memories, thoughts and fears, as seen by our inner eye. But what if each one of us is always dreaming, even when awake, and we only see what our inner eye creates for us? Is this what hell is? A world shaped by Senua's nightmares? Maybe that's why people feared seeing the world through her eyes. Because if you believe that Senua's reality is twisted, you must accept that yours might be too. You failed the gods. You're pathetic. Rotten. Cursed. What were you thinking? Did you really think you could win? How stupid can you be? Everyone hates her. She's cursed. Look at you. A warrior. Worthless. Weak. Pathetic. Go on. Feel sorry for yourself. Because there is no one left to do that for you. Everywhere. What's that? Take it. If you're too much of a coward to fight, then end the suffering. Broken and lost. Just Do like it. your sword. Do it. Come on. There. <laughs> Random. Why go on when you give everything and face that which torments you, only to find that it is worse than you could have imagined? Why go on? Is it really so weak to ask this? Or are we just so afraid of the honest answer? That we do not dare pose the question. Sometimes the answer lies in a memory, a feeling, a song. Okay, so we've completed the bridge section, we've met Hella, and we had a long ass cutscene there. So that's pretty much like around half an hour, so I'm gonna end it there, and that'll be the end of part four. Next time, part five, we'll follow the light or whatever of their Dillion and uh, try to see where it takes us, I guess. So thanks for watching, it's still awesome, and I'll see you guys next time, so join me next time for that for part five. So thanks a lot for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.